Hey there! Uh oh, my cat fell. <laughs> hey there! Welcome to my channel. If you want to know how I did this barbed wire makeup, keep watching. Alright, I'm starting with my mouth and some tape. Um, it was the only tape I had. Obviously, it's too colorful and it was hard to uh, conceal. So if you have regular tape, use that instead of that weird green and yellow tape. I don't even know where I got it from. Anyway, so I'm trying to cover that tape with liquid latex and I'm going to be applying three layers of latex. And actually, off camera, what I'll do is I will also put a little bit of toilet paper so that the liquid foundation that you see me applying will stick and, and stay on the liquid latex. So yeah, make sure you add some toilet paper or cotton or uh, you use a different tape, like a better one, I guess. So yeah, here I'm putting on liquid foundation, but it, yeah, it was not covered fully, so I had to apply toilet paper. Now with a defined brush and concealer, I am quickly drawing the lines where I want the barbed wire to be. Hey, I don't know what to do with my hands. Right, and now I'm creating the optical illusion effect that makes me look like my skin got, you know, ripped off and, and pulled uh, inward by the barbed wire. <laughs> I always use such small brushes to like fill in the shape. I, I mean, why don't I use a bigger brush? It takes forever to fill in with that. Yeah, I figured it was taking too long and I took a bigger brush. <laughs> right, I want my ears to be gone with the background, so I'm painting them as well. Should have painted my hair as well, or put on a bald cap, I guess. But I, honestly, I, well, I didn't have a bald cap, and uh, I didn't think it mattered at the time. So anyway, now I'm painting well, Bob Barrier, and uh, I found this great step-by-step -step picture on Google on how to draw Bob Wire. I put in the, the video description if you are interested in drawing Bob Wire. <laughs> Who knows? But it's the same steps over and over again you draw five uh, parallel lines and then you want the the two ones at the end to on both at both ends to be longer and then you want all the lines to meet with arced lines and uh, that's basically it then you will fill in fill everything in with gray or i mean any lighter color and uh, once you've done that you will give the bot wire more realism and dimension with white paint you're gonna be using white paint uh, patches of white so that it looks like your bob wire is actually three-dimensional and reflecting the light I am adding thin lines uh, to make my skin look like it's uh, pulled and uh, you know broken I don't know how to explain and uh, I'm gonna be repeating the same thing on the rest of my face
I decided to fill that in black because, I don't know, I think it looked weird. I wanted to make it look like there was a hole on the side of my mouth. And yeah, now I'm just painting the last uh, last piece of... Oh, no, I went back to the cheek because I forgot the, the white to make it look three-dimensional. So yeah, back to the, to the neck with the last piece of barbed wire. And uh, we are almost done, guys. I don't know why I did that makeup. I and mean, I woke up and I thought, hey, I want to paint barbed wire. I have no idea why. <laughs> Right now, as you can see, I've, I've drawn shadows below the bulb wire on my cheek and uh, chin, I guess. And I'm repeating the process here with um, a dark gray eyeshadow. And I'm trying to like reproduce the shape of the bulb wire. And because, uh, you know, the, the whole toilet paper thing on my cheek looks a little bit bad, I decided to add scratches with a fan brush and a blood color that I created by mixing red and black. All right, guys. Um, I would love to give you, I would like, uh, start over. <laughs> this is really hard. It's hard to talk with this thing on. Uh -huh, guys. I am completely losing it right now. And uh, I can't really talk because I have this, I have latex and some tape on my mouth. But anyway, yeah, that's it guys. I hope you liked it. Leave me a thumbs up if you did and subscribe to my channel. Leave me a comment down below in the comment box and I'll see you soon. Bye. <laughs>